Here we go. Welcome to the beach. There you go. It's pretty cool actually. Do you have to admit, I think this is the first time they've actually done it in a few years' time. Now my wheels in motion and my windows open with the wind blowing in my head. I'm driving down the highway, gonna do this my way. I can feel it in the air. Here I go. everyone welcome to today's vlog and welcome to Wednesday yeah how are you all doing today yes yeah, so we're up to centre MK today yeah we, um, we need to start getting a couple of bits and pieces for the kids for school so might as well get it done now while we've got the opportunity oh, to going. and because we aren't going to the beach as such we thought we'd bring Ben Bing to the beach at Milton Keynes so yeah um, so anyway yeah we're going to quickly show you around a second it's quite cool actually, they make it like a little um, funny like fun fairground thing as well. So if I turn you around, and this is what it's actually like inside, it's pretty cool actually. You've got like a little bungee jump things here, got like a little mini um, beach, um, helter skelter, little rise, and little. So it's pretty cool actually, to be honest with you. But anyway, first of all, we'll just pop into John Lewis, and Sarah needs to clean up, and then we're going to um, have fun on the beach. Yeah, so obviously, you pay here as well and obviously to get like little tokens and stuff so yeah the um bunch of trampoline to six tokens the sharp bay roller coaster is five what's that be five pound per person hook a duck is four tokens laughing clowns is four help the scout is three and train is actually three as well so yeah um obviously you can buy by car there as well which is pretty cool so yeah it's um it's good how they actually I've done it though, though, isn't it actually? So like if you can't go to like to the seaside, these they have got like little rise here. <laughs> what things they got on took a duck? Like it's four pounds a go. And you four tokens per person on this one. Yeah, also around here I've obviously got like little candy floss sweets and popcorn slushy things, yeah. Typical seaside thing, isn't it? So so we don't go on that roller coaster. No, not going on there yet, okay, it's just fine. Ooh, what else have got around here? got like a little um, chocolate fountain yeah, oh yeah flying tiger oh well, yeah the one in Banbury is actually closed now so again we're going to go on there for a little bit and then good Ellen yeah oh, if you want to look around the shops first yeah yes. okay okay yes yeah, so change the plan we're going to look around the shops first and then come back on to the beach a little bit later it looks pretty cool there and stuff though as well so um, so we've got 14 in a minute then, Ben J, isn't it, yeah? So anyway, yeah, so we just all look around our usual shops to want to have a look in. Um, I want to pop into the big massive Primarks here. It's a, it's, I think it's a three floor one now, I think it is. Obviously I need a new bag. This one's actually split like crazy. Bag, so yeah, and also going to have a look for new bags and stuff also for the kids as well. So anyway, all Primarks is down here. Should we have a look in Primarks first? in mankind now and these are pretty cool these are these pops actually come with the vinyl i know the 25 pound we've got acdc there britney spears avril ravine and the cure that's good though that's 45 quid though that one they've got like a pop poster with it as well so yeah these lots of quite cool things in there actually all the pops look at these six pops sammy they're wow. pretty cool aren't they obviously got to be careful because the music inside out too these are pretty that's so the two for 25 pounds look these little, they're pretty cool, aren't they? Mm. Not bad actually for 20 quid. Um, we've got the old Robin Light, we've got Dell and Rodney there. So they're right for collectors and that sort of thing, aren't they? Um, all the little stranger things here. These little stitch things, he gets everywhere Stitch does. These little, what are these, little figurines? It is actually come to, it is actually nice to come to the shopping centre with some, all the shops. I used to one of these in Banbury, but it actually closed down. For it being school holidays, I'm quite surprised Centre MK isn't 
busier than what it was. We actually found the parking space absolutely perfect, didn't we? Okay, I know a couple of people on holiday and stuff, yeah. but it's actually nice to come to a shopping centre where it's full of shops and stuff. So. No, it's because this is a very good shopping centre. It is actually a good Look. shopping centre. What's this? I've been that close. Pro- proper hamburgers, oh yeah. Um, so yeah, a little outdoor foodie yeah. place out here as well. Nando's is over there as well, which is pretty good. Um, you can actually feel, yeah, you can actually feel that sun through those windows. You really, really can. So yeah. Starbucks coffee over there as well. It's always nice to come to the bigger place because we've got to find more op- more choices and stuff like that. Look at the option here for gluten free range. You know what I mean? There's loads here. Um, it's a pity. It's not actually. The problem is we won't um, them diggy. Well, we we'll saving them for later, though, isn't it? So look at this. Look, skitty. That's something Ben would like. Gluten free, skitty carbonara, it's annual, it's two pounds fifty two. Loads of different options in here for him. Look that, skitty bolognese, which is reduced as well to two pounds seventy. Yes, there's loads of different options here for him as well. What did you see over here? Oh, you saw some of these, Susan saw some of these um, cheesecake trifles. Mm. Looks really, really nice. A bit expensive there for five pounds seventy five. It's alright for a treat every now and then though, isn't it? So. Oh, well. Out of it, so I want to go <coughs> you, right? We're going to go Sports Direct. We're going to go Sports come for Sports Direct, haven't we? And I've also come for the Lego store as well. So. To this day, it always amazes me how this is owned by two separate companies, isn't it? You've got Centre MK and you've got Into, Into as well, which is a totally different company and stuff like that. So, yeah, um, this is the part we come down for anyway, like I said, for the Lego shop. Sports Direct are actually supposed to be moved down here as well, so. Obviously, we need to pop in there. Stephen needs to get a couple of bits and pieces, don't you? What you need and stuff as well. Who can remember the upside down house in Great Yarmouth, eh, Sammy? Can you remember the, that? No, it wasn't. So this is. Uh, you know what, Ben? Where are we heading for? Ben's on the mission. What's he found? <laughs> I know Sammy misses Millet's cookies from here, didn't you, sweetheart? Yeah. Millet's cookies used to be around here and they used to love that. Be over there. It used to be over there, didn't it? Near where Starbucks used to be, I think it was. So, but yeah. What's that? Scientists have, have fresh hope for the survival of the world's largest crocodile species after six new Siamese crocodiles hatched in wild Cam- Cambodia. Oh, that's different, isn't it? So, being well, yeah, like I said, in the upside down house um, is on one of our vlogs from when we went to Great Yarmouth, isn't it? It's always a weird feeling because. You think, oh yeah, it's fine, but it's not. It's, it's a weird sensation. You don't realise how it feels until you've actually been inside one of those. Oh, What's on there? Oh yeah, oh, that sounds bright. Oh, that is hot. That's got really, really hot. Um, so you've okay, still got a new look here as well. Like I said, it's nice because you've got different shops here. You don't really know she's soon. So, oh no, it looks like, oh, it looks like it's coming soon to Sports Direct. What? Got Sports Direct coming soon, so maybe the I still think they've probably still probably got their old their old one where it is. Quite good, then. What's that, Sammy? That is a big Apple store. That is a big, big Apple store, isn't it? Oh my goodness, and that squats that's a bit more moved. I know. Look at the size of it. It's absolutely huge. This is this one, that one, and that one there. Oh, so I'm going to the shops anyway, yeah. I'm just going to pop in here. Uh, you can't come to Milton Kings without going inside the Lego shop. And I think I can see what I want. Lego can be a very expensive business to get into. Yeah, I got paid today and I'm going to treat myself to some Lego. I'm looking for the little Lego castle. What there is, out. Um, got some... Oh, down there, here it is. This is it. That's one I've already got, that one. There's another one, actually. That's not the one. That is my dream. Always is, that big, massive castle. But there's way I'm going to pay that price for that. It just it isn't worth it. No, yeah, but I've got that one. There was another one I was looking for. The uh, um, But I can't find that one. There you go. That's the one I wanted. That's the one, Sleeping Beauty Castle, yeah. Um, obviously, they've got them in two separate locations, so... Yeah, £35 for that Lego is not too bad actually. I get that built today. 
So are you go and pay it? Yeah, so it's that one. Can we pay it? Oh, look at that stitch over there, there, Sammy. It's going to be you fancy, isn't it? Anything you want in there, darling? No. No, you still got, okay, Sammy was using Lego. It's the first time we've heard of that before. Lego friends and stuff. What else they've got around here? Loads and loads of, all well, the brick heads for Harry Potter. Look at that though, look, 369 quid for that. It's just crazy prices, isn't it? It's just little bits of plastic, you know? But, yeah. Oh, I guess, Sammy, look at that F1 car. Whoa, that's £189, that bit of Lego. That's cool. It is pretty cool, though, isn't it? Car. It's a Petronius one, yeah. yeah. Got what do you want that, Sammy? Yeah. You want that one? Yeah. Okay, come that one if you want that you one. Promise me you'll make it up. Yeah, you got more yeah. to make them up. Or do you want some of these ones? This is actually eight ninety nine. Those. We've got some little Minecraft ones down here, Sammy. Or down here, I got I got some Super Mario. It's on the Hedgehog down here as well. What's that? What's that one? Oh, Sammy, get one or the other. Do the minions? You yeah. can't have both. Minions, one. Yeah, give me the minions one instead. So, yeah, these are pretty cool, aren't they? These little minion ones. Mm. And I know it's exactly this. Oh, cool, aren't they? Really cool. Got minions and banana car. <laughs> and then they've got other little Lego 3D creator sets as well. Um, and they're about actually £13.49, are they? All the Lego City things over here as well. Look at that train, Sammy. That train looks pretty cool, £139. And you've got like the little Lego City yeah. brick one there as well. That is £89. So I like these. These are pretty cool. Like these New York. Yeah. What are these? Or Sammy, it's in there. You've got the Minions Lego, or you can have like the little New York Skyline. What do you like? I can have this bit of cubby for. You want the you want the minions Lego, that's absolutely yeah. fine. So yeah, that's, if you want that then we'll do that, yeah? We'll probably make that tomorrow or something. My dad is at work, yeah? Maybe tomorrow. Yeah. I'm so apologise if the light's flickering. I think it's the light and it's causing all to flicker, but yeah. Look at that R2 detour thing over there, darling. While you're in the queue, I'll see how much he is. He is £209.99, so yeah, a little bit expensive, but Oh well, it's in Sports Direct now. Sam has picked his bag. Um, it'll show you that when we get home what he's actually picked. It wasn't too bad actually, £20. Anyway, yeah, I'm just um, seeing these. These actually only £15 reduce these little um, Disney things. I'm not too quite sure exactly what they are, but like a little Cheshire cat, the Beauty and the Beast, Enchanted Rose, and these Alice in Wonderland things. So, what's my today then? Um, yeah, bless him, this lift though, he's going to lift upstairs, but not going upstairs, don't need to, but yeah, I think they're quite cute actually. Oh, they're like a little figurey thing or something. I don't want to get them down because I've got Ben here, so, but yeah, and so like I said, it seems weird actually having a um, game in with Sports Direct, but they still have got their game store as well, so I'm not too quite sure that's still open. But yeah, they've got some of their Lego mm. reduced as well, it's only £10, their Lego there. And there's Emma Crossing things here, these dreamy things. I've still got all their games there as well, so. I'm just looking at that. Oh, it's actually a Lego set for 56 quid. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Um, yeah, it's different. What right then, Ben? Do I see that? Yeah? I think your, your school bag's right there, isn't it? Yours one is, so. Here we have long replace. I've been learning how to replace Ben, so that's not too bad, so. Sammy, did you get your bag? Yeah, I yeah. did. Yeah? Oh, that's good. It's going to be much better this store when it moves over there. It's going to be so much better when it moves back over to the big yeah, store, isn't it? What? Yeah. Well, let's see, Ben kept trying to try go into the lift. Yeah. So, yeah, so like I said, it's, here, it's seen here, it's all quite all crammed in together, isn't it? Yeah. These, when it moves over to the other one, like I said, it's going to be a lot more... It's a bigger store, but they're only going into two places. Look at the price of them, look. Two for 75 quid. This is the place that does my shoes. Isn't it? Yes, they do do your shoes here, don't they? So, and um, someone's got their birthday coming up. Someone's got their birthday coming up soon, now, haven't they? Yeah. It's your birthday. Oh, well, got that push car, Sammy. That's a Tesla, that's a Tesla car. Would you ever fancy an electric car? No, because when we 
Have well, we got I Ben's car? Touch, I won't touch an electric car to the improved quality and the No, because when we, when we chose Ben's car, we was offered an electric car, wasn't we? Mm. But we said no, because it just had the few amount of miles we do. Um, just imagine we'll probably get halfway down the M25 or something and it dies on us. But anyway, yeah, so... Um, ooh, that's a different type of shop there, Sammy. The Dutch Hospital. Well, I've got some weird little things in there and stuff like that so but yeah all the way back to Central NK now yeah anyway at least you've got what we come for yeah. which is one good thing and you've got your school bag you've got your school bag didn't you sweetheart yeah. <laughs> you got you picked some lego with your money because you got your money yesterday didn't you yeah so you picked some lego with your money what you wanted yeah. and then we're gonna um just before we go back to school we're gonna go into the bank and sort out your bank account aren't we it's always fun you know, it is, why do you want to go with? What bank do you want to go with? No worries. You'll go with Lloyd's bank, okay? Yeah. That's fine. That's a big water stone in there, isn't it? they've done this. This is actually an empty shop, but as you can see, they made it into a map. You can actually see where everything is, which is a really good idea, actually, isn't it, Sammy? Um, well, then, what's your favourite shop from here, then, Sammy? Where um, can we see it? Got Costa Coffee, look, Krispy Kreme. Um, what's that? All the big ones on here aren't they as well so it's pretty good actually because at least in that way if it tells you where you are there as well yeah. so i do like that idea and actually they, they put the signs back up oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah put all the big signs back up as yeah. well so and they got the yeah. big map um, yeah no i do like the big map actually really do like the big map um got mcdonald's here obviously Again, we've not had a McDonald's for ages. You asked in the McDonald's for ages, but you've had one just recently, haven't you? You had one with school, college, and then Ben had one then just before they broke up as well. One of my favourites, Shop Lush, with all the bath bombs. I've still got loads of bath bombs at home, so I don't need any more at the minute. Ben, don't pull my hair, darling. It's a sign you need to get your Well, what is? It is, actually. I know. Here we go. Welcome to the beach. There you go. It's pretty cool actually, do you have to admit? I think this is the first time they've actually done it in a few years' time. I was told earlier, please let the beach be clear, three or five or four places in time. That's not too bad. So, yeah. Um, well, cause it's pretty cool how they've actually done it. So, but where are we going to go then, darling? Yeah, so if we can't go to the beach properly, this will make do as well. So, yeah, I'm not going to do too much work in here actually because there's it's quite a few people on here. So, but yeah, it's that fine, like, you can tell it's definitely like the play sand and stuff like that, but it's good they offer it as well for those um, and stuff like that. So yeah, they do. They do um, do like offer the buckets and space, but they've all gone anyway. So yeah. So anyway, yeah, we're just back from Milton Keynes. Was you quite surprised on Milton Beans on Milton Keynes how how it wasn't busy? What? Oh no, it's like people away and stuff like that sort of thing. But anyway, yeah, we got what we we we, we come back with what we went for in the first place, which was great, didn't we? Mm. And we yeah, so this is Sammy's new school bag. He actually picked, got it from Sports Direct. And it's quite a nice, decent size actually. I think it's a lot bigger than his Legoland bag, but yeah, mm. it's a new, his Legoland bag. It's um, where it's been hanging it all up. It's starting to fray here at the top, so um, yeah, it needed a new one. So yeah, so Ben's is okay for now. But I think he might need one soon, if that makes sense. So, yeah, we said what Paul we might do is we'll um, just before he goes back to school, we'll check and see if he does need one. Anyway, yes, yeah, the additional price for this, believe it or not, was actually £40, believe it or not. And we actually got this one for 20 which I thought wasn't too bad because um, it's got like two zips. Get the side. It's also got like the pockets at the size here. So, if he goes out and about, we've got at least a cabbage ring. In this pocket here as well. It's got the nice big thick solder straps. I was a bit disappointed because I got told the new Sports Direct was open. It wasn't. It wasn't. I thought it was open, but it wasn't. Mm. Um, obviously, like I said, you've got a nice decent sized pocket in there, and then you open the big main pocket. And um, one thing with this one, oh no, actually, it's got three pockets. It's got like a little nice little pocket in there as well, which is pretty cool actually, to be honest with you. So this must be the main pocket. Yeah, if I open the big main pocket in here, I've got two little zips to it as well, which is good. So yeah, open it all up. Oh yeah, he was right. It has got like, it's also got three with it. You've got a little pencil case. I know it's not a brilliant size, but that'd be okay. It's 
got a nice little water bottle, which should be a good one. So if you want to go on your days out and stuff, you can take this one because it's one of those ones where obviously you take the top off there and I'll imagine it is one of those ones where, yeah, got top there as well, which is pretty cool. And obviously then he's got like a little lunch box as well. So because obviously I know he's going to have school dinners, but if they go on days out and stuff, it's going to need, and it's quite a nice little size there and a little size little bag there as a little lunch box there. So yeah, I'm going to, obviously he because he won't need them straight away, so I can put them up. But anyway, yeah, you open the bag. So what, it's quite a nice decent sized bag actually. Really good, really big things inside. Sammy? You come and see this. Look, look at your bag. Look at those look. It's yeah. most decent to the side, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway, do you want to put this on the peg? Yeah, yeah I'm put this on the peg. I'm not going to put your lunch box, your pencil case, or your water bottle in there because you won't need them yet, will you? Until, not until. Not until you go back to school, and not until you go back out and about the school. But anyway, yeah. Um, like I said, just got a cup of tea now. And we're just going to sit this, watch this, and watch this and then picks. Yeah, and Britain has done quite well. Is it two gold medals or three gold medals they've won today? I know they've won quite. A f I know they've won two silvers, so definitely haven't we? And I know they've won a couple of silvers, but I'm not too quite sure. But anyway, yeah, they're doing really well. So, yeah, um, just going to chill out now for a few afternoon, I think. Yeah. So yeah, so that brings today's vlog to a close. Yeah, it's quite a nice trip actually to the little thing. I have to excuse the noise, Stephen's playing with his cleaver. He um, saw one advertised on the, um, what is it, the shopping channel? What does it advertise? Um, it's, yeah, it's the Daniel Mel Haven. Let's have a look at the camera and show you, really. It's one of these little, one of those little things like that. Look, it's really cool. Oh, Victor's one. Yeah? It's got loads of things to it. Like I said, I've seen this point mainly for the car to be honest with you. But any bit of dust or crab is picking up with this little thing. But tell you what though, it'd be good for the stairs, if you have to admit that, because the lead on our hoover isn't that brilliant and um, you get halfway to the top of the stairs and it's stuck and you get stuck. So yeah, that'd be ideal for that. Well I try tell you what I'll we'll try it on the stairs tomorrow so it gets on. Yeah. Um like I said, yeah, we've like, so we wanted to put on keys, got everything we wanted to get. Obviously, Sammy's got his new school bag and stuff like that. So, um, but yeah, because like, it's been another hot one today, actually, to be honest with you. And what is it calling down? Weekend. Weekend, yeah, the default forecast from thunder showers. The Met Office have issued an amber warning for the weather. No, no. I was a yellow warning. So, but anyway, yeah, so this one's there. Anyway, this one's there. Thanks for watching today. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and then we'll see you in our next video. Oh, by the way, I'd like to say a big thank you to Becky for becoming a member. Um, yeah, if you want to become a member, there is a join button there. So, um, like I said, thanks for watching, and then we'll see you tomorrow at 5 p.m. Bye, everybody.